Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to recreate the look that Ashwarya was wearing at the Cannes 2015 film festivals. I thought she looked absolutely stunning. And yeah, I tried to recreate the hair and the makeup. So if you want to see how I did that, please keep on watching. So I'm starting off with my Vichy foundation, the Derma Blend in 45 Gold and applying this all over my face with my stippling brush. And for concealer, I'm using my Maybelline Fit Me in the number 10 as always and applying it under my eyes. And making sure that everything is nicely blended. So now it's time for eyes and I like using the Art Deco eyeshadow base first so that my eyeshadow doesn't budge and it stays on longer. So I'm using my Naked palette again because it just has the prettiest neutral colors ever and Ashwarya was very nude as well. And I'm starting off with the color Buck as my transition color and applying this into my crease. Next, I'm using the color Sidecar. This is a really pretty shimmery silver color and applying this into the inner two-thirds of my eye. And here I'm just going in with the transition color again just to blend it all out nicely. As a highlight, I'm using the color Virgin and applying this underneath my brows. For eyeliner, I'm using my P2 gel eyeliner in 100% black and applying this along my lash line <laughs> and also creating a little flick at the end. So next I'm using my YSL baby doll mascara and it's so tiny because it's a sample size obviously it's not the full size so yeah here I am just applying a nice coat Next I'm using this Avon glimmer stick in black and tight lining my upper waterline with it so Ashwarya's highlight of her whole makeup look was obviously the green on her waterline. So I tried recreating this with this pencil liner which I have seriously no clue where I got it from but it just did not work at all as you can see you can't even see the color so I switched over to my sleek ultra mattes we one brights palette so I'm using the color dragonfly first which is the third one in the second row and then the color cricket which was the last one in the first row yeah so here I'm just saying that they're really pretty so I'm using my angled brush and applying the darker color which was dragonfly on my lower waterline. And to 
make the green stand out even more, I used Cricut, which was the lighter green color, and applied it on top of the dark green color. <laughs> For bronzer, I'm using my Maybelline Dream Sun bronzer in the number 2 golden and applying this underneath my cheekbones. And for blush, I use the Sans Souci Natural Color Multi Blush and Highlighter Dew Set. <laughs> Um, and yeah, I use the blush color as my blush. And for highlighter, I'm using my Mary Lumalizer as always with my fan brush and applying it on my high on the high points of my cheeks, on the bridge of my nose, and on my cupid's bow. I just like going overboard with my highlighter. The lip liner I'm using is by Manhattan and I cannot remember the name right now but it will be in the info box below. All the products that I'm using will be in the down bar below so don't forget to check that out. As you can see, I'm applying my lip liner only on the outer corners of my lips and that will give me a really nice ombre effect when I apply my lipstick later on. Okay, not later on now. <laughs> so I'm using the Sleek Lip for Lipstick Palette in Tees and taking the color Spotlight and applying it wherever I left out my lip liner. <laughs> And to blend out these two colors, I'm using my Catrice Ultimate Color Lipstick in Pink Me Up. Can't forget the second coat of mascara. So that's the makeup look so far. Now let's move on to hair. So I'm just taking my straightener and choosing some random strands and curling my hair outwards and then taking my ha my hands sorry and um, loosening them out. that's the final look guys I really hope that you love this and if you do then don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you haven't already as I already said all the infos will be in the down bar below so don't forget to check that out and if you've got any kind of suggestions leave that in the comments below as well and yeah I really hope to see you guys in my next video again until then stay fabulous <laughs> love you guys bye